Hello boys and girls, this is Miss Judy. Today's lesson is about weight. This is a weighing scale and we can also call it a balance scale. I want to use it today to compare the weights of two objects. You guys can make your own weighing scales at home. It's very easy. In order to do the same weighing scale as this one, I use two plastic cups. You need a wooden stick in order to make the holes in the cup and then you get some sewing threads to connect the plastic cups to the plastic coat hanger. The plastic coat hanger is the most important part because you need it in this activity and the pair of scissors you need to use it for the sewing threads to cut them. Now let me tell you about the fun part about this activity. Here's the fun part in which you need to go to find random items around the house, all around your house to fill the containers. Personally, I collected this stuff. It's up to you guys. So let me start using my weighing scale. Let me now pick from my basket to compare the weights of two objects. Remember, I need two objects. So I'll choose the body cream and I'll choose the balloon. Okay. Look carefully, guys. What do you realize? What happened here? So when I compare the weight of two objects, one object is heavier or lighter than the other or both can weigh the same. So look, the cup with the body cream went down, the cup with the balloon went up. The cup with the heavier object always goes down and the cup with the lighter object goes up. So which object is heavier? Your answers, please. Okay, so the container with the body cream is heavier than the container with the balloon. So the container with the balloon, let me move this a bit. The container with the balloon is lighter than the container with the body cream. Thank you. Let's try something else. Let me remove these and put them away so that we can put something else. Okay, I have that huge eraser. Uh oh, uh oh. And I want to use these scotch tapes. Now you tell me guys, what happened? What do you realize? Just help me out please. Mmm, so let's take a look. The cup with the eraser went down and the cup with the scotch tapes went up. So which is heavier and which is lighter? The container with the scotch tape is lighter than the container with the eraser. So the container with the eraser is heavier than the one with the scotch tapes. Okay, let's try something else. Now, I have two pens, one black and one red. I'll put the black one here and the red one here. Take a look and tell me guys, what do you realize? Which is heavier and which is lighter? Is it the red one which is heavier or the black one? And which is lighter? Or what do you think? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I think that they have the same weight. They weigh the same. None of the containers went up or down they stay as is because they have the same weight. Thank you. 
Let's try something else. What if I try with a biscuit pack? Uh oh. And the Mentos container. What do you realize? Which is heavier and which is lighter? Okay. So the one that went down is the heavier one. It's the heavy object. And the one that went up is the light object. So the biscuit pack is heavier than the Mentos container. And the Mentos container is lighter than the biscuit pack. Okay, let's try something else. Let me take these out. Okay, now count with me. I'll use some butter cups. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, what do you think happened? What do you realize? Which is heavier and which is lighter? Or are they the same? Do they have the same weight? Yes, sir. Ooh. Okay. Let me put them out. And now I want to try with a cup of water. I'll put it in this container. And in the other container, I want to put a cup of cereal. Boys and girls, what do you realize? Share with me your thoughts. What do you realize? What happened now? Okay, so the cup with the water is heavier than the cup with the cereal. Why do you think so? So, the cup of cereal is lighter than the cup of water. It's because, what do you think? Your answers, please. Mm-hmm. So, one object is heavier or lighter than the other. And the lighter one went up and the heavier one went down. Thank you, boys and girls. This is the end of our lesson. I would like you to share with me your own balance scales or weighing scales. You can come up with your choice of balance or weighing scales. Be creative as much as you can. I hope you enjoyed my lesson. See you soon and have fun, enjoy it.